Hello guys, since we are just taking up the videos from computer network, so this is another video in the same series and in the same sequence I should say. And this question has also come in gate 2015 and it was a one more question and it is also from stop and wait protocol. So just uh, let's just discuss it and uh, the I'll just write down my main formula since many of you must have not viewed the previous video in case you have not please view the previous one but nevertheless i list down the important formulas that i'll be using in this uh, question so channel utilization is defined for stop and wait protocol is defined as tt by tt plus 2 tp where this tt is the transmission speed sorry transmission time and tp is the propagation delay or the propagation time and this denominator basically signifies the total time of one cycle and TT basically represents the total active time of the sender, right? So, when, when I divide the numerator and the denominator by TT, I get 1 upon 1 plus 2 TP upon TT. And we also know that transmission time TT is F by R, where F is the frame size in bits and R is the bit rate. It is also referred to as bandwidth many a times in the questions and TP is the propagation delay which is D by V D is the distance which is uh, which has to be taken in SI units or the standard units which is in meters and V is the speed or the velocity to be taken in meters per second so the question is huh? the question is a link has a transmission speed of 10 to power 6 bits per second. So this is a transmission speed but please look down it is bits per second. That means it is what? It is the bit weight. So the question might give you some confusing terms like this. It might mention something which may not mean the same thing. So you need to verify it by looking at the units. Right. It says it uses data packet packets of size 1000 bytes each so we note down that we need to convert the these bytes into bits right and the efficiency of the stop and wait protocol in this particular setup is exactly 25 percent so the efficiency or the utilization of the channel is given to be as 25 percent please note down the efficiency is another synonym which comes in the questions for your channel utilization the value of one way propagation delay is so they've asked the value of tp the propagation delay so uh, as i solve the questions i just write down first of all whatever is given in the question so i jot down the given things over here so the given is r is given to be as 10 to power 6 bits per second s is given to be as 1000 bytes which is 8000 bits and i find out tt quickly because i have both these parameters required for tt so it comes out to be 8000 upon 10 to power 6 which is 8 milliseconds right and then i need tp which is required in the question and i have utilization as 25 percent so now i'll put both these values in my utilization formula over here so i just write down the values and i simplify and what i get is what i get is x is equals to 12 and since i took 8 in milliseconds it was over here but i took it directly i wrote it as 8 so my this answer which came as 12 is also in milliseconds and i also required it in milliseconds right so that's all for this question of computer networks which is also a very important question in the next session i'll be taking up a question from go back end sliding window protocol which also comes for channel utilization so please uh, view that video as well and in case you like the video please like it and keep subscribed yourself for more good work coming up and keep following the channel thank you